one of my favorite moments when I was in Israel was the moment that I got to see the Western Wall. It used to be called the Wailing Wall. We were there on Sabbath and it was crazy. There, were, First of all, there was a lot of people. But one of the things I noticed right away is how many of the Jews that were there to worship on that day were just filled with all kinds of excitement. In fact, one of my best moments was watching these men with their arms around each other all in this circle and they're singing at the top of their lungs. And then, I, I don't know what they're saying, but then they they backed up and they started to whisper like they're building up this momentum. And all of a sudden they, they got to this point and they just all began to yell and sing and jump around like some kind of Jewish mosh pit. It was incredible. But I couldn't help but think of the passage in Romans that, there, that says that they were zealous for God, but their zeal was without knowledge. I love their passion, but they missed their Messiah. And so it really got me thinking about what our excuse is. What's your excuse for not being passionate about God? Yeah, you go through the motions. I know that. You, you do your thing. But are you really passionate about your Savior? No one has done more for you than Jesus has done for me for you. No one has loved you like God has loved you. So be passionate for him. The people in this life that should have the most passion should be those that have been saved by God's amazing grace. Hey, this has been your one thing for Saturday. <laughs>